Not yet. We know that police are investigating that, but we did just speak with them and they tell us that this was not random. So you can see there's a few businesses here and they were actually opening up. The shooting happened around 10 yesterday morning. Most of those shots landed right outside of these businesses, but some also actually traveled all the way across the street. You can see there's traffic that goes by here and hit some of the buildings over there. We saw at least one bullet hole in the roof of that building across the street and a couple of cars they had damage. Luckily, it appears that no one was hurt. When officers got to the scene, no one required medical attention. Investigators are looking, though, at a couple of cars that may have been involved in this shooting. One of the witnesses that we spoke with today was still shaken up. She says she was outside the shop just minutes before that shooting started, but went inside to help a customer. Gunshots don't have or shells don't have eyes, you know, so they could have been shooting at the store at me at you know, the customer. I wasn't sure what was going to happen, you know, and all I kept worrying about was my three kids and hoping to God that I would live to see them again because you just never know. The woman we spoke with says that she heard different types of pops or gunshots, but investigators are still working to determine if this was a shootout, as in two-way gunfire. If you have any information, police are asking for your help in this case. Call their tips hotline. They say as of this afternoon, they have not made any arrests. Reporting in KCK, I'm Carolina Cruz, KCTV 5 News. Thank you, Carolina, for that update. What a 